Well, they've given him a chance. They have given this guy a chance. Oh, boy, here we go. Boom! Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Of course, most of the finalists in our never-ending search for the world's worst drivers are the drivers who choose to drive stolen cars. Most of these cars, when driven by their tempering new owners, always seem to be driven in a similar fashion, as fast as possible, endangering as many police and innocent motorists as possible, and crashing into as many other vehicles as possible. And at the end of it all, usually getting caught, usually getting hurt, sometimes seriously. But this is one solution. It's the helicopter, the police department's eye in the sky, that's really upsetting the bad guys. Once the police air wing has locked onto you, the chances of escaping are extremely slim. It's after dark, but the helicopter's infrared system has helped lead highway patrol cars to this stolen vehicle. It looks like a video game, but it's deadly and it's real. Police box the crook in, but forget about this little gap. Now the police are angry, and you never want to make police that angry. The car on the left is travelling on the wrong side of the road on a British motorway. It was funny when Steve Martin and John Candy did it in planes, trains and automobiles, but this is a disaster waiting to happen. Beside it, on the correct side of the barrier, is a police car trying desperately to stop him. It turns out the driver had just passed his test and never driven on a motorway before. This four-wheel drive has been stolen by an escapee. Not a fast chase, this one. He can't decide whether to drive on or off the road. Eventually, he stops and opens the door to get out. But when police arrive, he changes his mind. Then tries to head back to the road, but his mind is changed again, this time by that tree. Yet another bank robber trying to outrun the law. At high speed, he belts into a truck and bounces off the curb, blowing a tire. Forced to stop, he makes a run for it. And here it is, ladies and gentlemen, a bank robber's nightmare. Broke and busted and on this show. Now, this is the one you'll be talking about with your friends tomorrow, so watch carefully. It's New Zealand. The stolen white Ford Laser is full of young joyriders who have led police on a frustrating and often dangerous chase. It's classic cat and mouse, cops and robbers stuff. After many attempts and near misses, a police car manages to tap the laser into a slide. Now, watch this. Incredibly, none of the police were injured in that debacle. The car eventually brought to a stop. Four burly officers have a little chat to the driver. As well as being perfect for tracking getaway cars, 
Helicopters also allow pursuing patrol cars to hang back a little bit and not get involved in frantic and dangerous high-speed chases in built-up areas. Once in a suitable position, officers on the ground can be directed quickly to intercept. Case in point. Back down on the ground, this speeding Mercedes is being driven by its owner. After radioing his registration number back to base, the pursuing police are given his home address. And that's exactly where he's going. He was in such a hurry to park his car and run into the house, he knocked down his carport. Another person anxious to escape police is the driver of this stolen motorcycle. Now, in normal road conditions, particularly here where it's busy and the streets are narrow, you would think a motorbike could easily outrun a police car. But watch how the police driver skillfully follows the motorcycle. And for the first time in five World's Worst Drivers programs, we see an escaping crook stop at a red light. But not for long. And finally, the police decide it's time to fight fire with fire and bring in the cavalry. Not all police are that patient, and there are a few other, well, honourable methods of stopping stolen motorbikes available to the constabulary. Nudge, nudge, wink, wink. We're not chasing anyone here, just right place, right time. Unbelievably, the driver escaped unhurt. So, you want to give your furniture that distressed look. The elderly driver of this car has loaded it to the gills. The scary thing is, none of this stuff is tied down. It's just kind of balancing there. And to entertain police while they booked him, this guy played his accordion. True. How's this for a suicidal modification? No steering wheel, just a wheel brace held on by tape. Are Volvos really that safe? Are they that safe that you can drive it with the bonnet up? Now watch to the left. A combi that can't take no more. Oh, his dad must be so proud. He taught him how to drive. That wood is through both front windows. Police told us he had his hands underneath the wood holding the steering wheel. If you see a slippery when wet sign and a high wind area sign close to each other, this is what they're trying to tell you. Don't you hate it when your caravan has a different holiday destination to you? Remember, this is Europe. The driver's on the left. Oh, cruise control. That means you can stick your foot out the window, sit back, and relax. After the break, the very best of the world's worst cyclists. Over 18 years, it's become one of the world's greatest sporting traditions. State of origin. The game that turned boys into men and men into legends. Now the legends are marching home. 
united under one banner, the heroes of League, the best of the best. In the ultimate contest that turns friend into foe in the quest for origin glory. New South Wales take on Queensland at the Sydney Football Stadium in game one of the Harvey Norman State of Origin series. Live and exclusive to nine, 7.30 Friday. The new quiet Mitsubishi Verada XI is a true luxury car. It has a full leather interior, automatic climate control, a 10-stack CD player, SRS airbags, and ABS brakes. It's also so aerodynamic that with a 3.5-litre 24-valve V6 engine, it simply flies. Put the Grace Brothers May sale in your diary because you'll get 30% off all Heritage Manchester and Homewares. You'll get three for the price of two on selected Kayser and Colotex hosiery. You'll get Air Edge Max from Nike for $99.95. And you'll get at least 30% off selected Nike apparel. If you want great deals, then get down to the Grace Brothers May sale because you'll definitely get great prices and more at your Grace Brothers store. GoldenEye 007. The first Bond adventure. Where you direct the action. Do you know how to use one of these? Shot by shot by shot. Buy the Nintendo 64 system and the GoldenEye 007 game. Get the Smash It movie on video free. That's right, your very own copy of GoldenEye free. But only for a limited time. Everyone has a dream to own their own home. So we came up with the St George Great Australian Home Loan. A low, variable rate of just 6.15% per annum. Flexible repayments, redraw. We can arrange it over the phone or come to your place. Oh, get on, Jeff. Everybody! This is Jeff. He got us the loan to buy the house. Make your Great Australian dream come true. Call 133555 or 131346. Welcome to St George. At Jeans West, it has come to our attention that not everybody has the same length legs. So our jeans are now available in two different leg lengths. What? Jeans West fits best. Welcome back. Even if you are mature, sensible, smart, with quick reflexes and good instincts, our roads can still kill you. Of all the horrifying stories that occur daily on our roads, the tragedies involving children are perhaps the most sobering. So educating kids properly about how to behave on or near the roads is so very important and something we should all do. A school kid in a rush to get home. Unhurt, but understandably shaken. You know those nodding dogs on some rear windows? Well, meet the new version. And meet the very worst of the world's worst parents. Illegal and very dangerous. It might be fun up the front of Dad's van. But without a seatbelt, you're asking for trouble. This motorist has done a U-turn from the stream of oncoming traffic. Now, how's he going to get out of this? Of course, he calmly removes the witch's hats so he can join the motorway on the other side. And whilst this was going on, the police were already on the way to book him. In some countries, a pedestrian crossing is not necessarily the safest place to cross the road. Remember this wandering moped rider from our previous episode? 
you're probably wondering why he's wandering so much. Too much wandering juice, perhaps. Will sitting down make it any better? This time, a wandering car. One glancing blow to the centre barrier. And a more permanent one on the side of the road. Cycling drunk must make you very tired. Now this cyclist has left his sense of direction and logic at the pub. Well, the bar closes at six and the sun sets in the south, I mean the west, and then the bar opens again at 11, so maybe I'll just sleep here. When it comes to riding a bike, you've either got it or you ain't. And when it comes to walking, the same theory applies. 7.30 Thursday on 9. Get away. We're back for another great year. We name Australia's top 10 tourist attractions. Enjoy your own slice of paradise for just 25 bucks a night. I'm thinking good value. David discovers Moscow doesn't measure up. It's dirty. It's depressed. Get me the hell out of here. See the sights of New York with the real Kramer. I'm taking you to the spot, baby. Let's do it. And who better to road test a million-dollar kids club? That's mad. The all-new season of Getaway Thursday on 9. Your voice can reach out across oceans of time and distance. Hello? Hey, when are you coming home? This week, from 6pm Wednesday to 9am Thursday morning, you can call the UK, USA, New Zealand, Ireland and Canada and pay no more than $20 per hour with Telstra International Direct. It's just one of the ways Telstra's making it easier for your voice to reach the people you love. Otherwise, well, it's cold over here. Need to save some money? Well, the sale is on now at Kmart, with savings for the whole family. Like this pack of three Huntingdale bath towels for only $19.95. And save $22.95 on Performer 6-litre paint, now only $25. And save a whopping 25% off selected kids' tops and bottoms. And take 10% off all computer and video game software. With all the sale offers in this week's Kmart catalogue, the sale at Kmart is just what you need. Every cigarette is doing you damage. Smoking creates blood clots, which can cause strokes. Some strokes kill, blind, or paralyze. Others you don't even know you're having. This is the result of a minor stroke in a smoker, aged 38. Every cigarette is doing you damage. For a new car? How about a Nissan 200 SX Limited for just $39,990 drive away with free CD player? Or a Nissan Pathfinder TI for $43,990 at Nissan's end of financial year sale. Hurry, ends June 30. She's the world's <laughs> most revered entertainer. I hope that's true. And Mike Munro has the exclusive. It's nice to be happy. Barbara Streisand My Life premieres next. Well, that's it for tonight. Another half-hour lesson in how not to drive. Another batch of highway and byway bruises and losers bites the dust. Remember, as we always say, you could be the best driver in the world, but one of the very best of the world's worst drivers, riders, cyclists or pedestrians, could be just around the corner. So take it easy. Good night.
Uh, Ma'am, have you anything to drink tonight? No, sure. I was a little bit bloodshot, and your speech is a little bit slurred. Okay, I, want I had you, a beer. I want you to be honest, okay? I had a beer. Okay. Now, what I want you to do is I want you to put your left foot on that line first. Okay, put your left foot. Oh, hang, on, hang on. Okay, now put your right foot in a heel-to-toe fashion, just like that. Okay, on the line there. Okay, now hold that position just for a second. Do you want to go ahead and take one last drag off that cigarette? Cause that... Nope. Okay, do you want to put it down then? Nope. Are you going to hold on to it? Yep. Okay, hang on, hang one. on. Take nine heel-to-toe steps down the line. Hang one. on. <laughs> You're right. What the f***? Dude, let's go. Well, I, I'm I trying to. Uh, well, out I know. Here. I'm trying to explain everything to you. Okay. Right, nine steps. Get, pivot. Nine steps. I got it. I got it. I got it. I'll do. Listen. Relax. One, two, three, four, five. This thing six, on every step. Seven, Arms up. Eight, nine. Pivot. And then nine steps back. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, flip-flops. No, uh, well, we didn't want any flip-flops. Okay. Okay. I need you to give me this hand here, because at this point, ma'am, you're under arrest for driving under the influence. Okay? You want me to stand on like this? No, head? no. Right now, I need I need to tell you you're under arrest, okay? No, no you want no, me to stand on No, like... I'll, I'll do is listen to me. I just told you. I understand that. No, you don't need a doctor's note. You f***ing piece of No sense being me now, Adil. You piece of No sense being me. No.